green flags in the air. Tanner Grow, Mike Waddle will lead him into turn number one. And it will be Tanner Grow with the race lead off of turn number two. Mike Waddle finds himself in that second spot. Trying to look to the outside there with Tanner Grow. His car's going to actually push up the racetrack. Does Mike Waddle's hot ride as the 45K of Austin Cool. And that third spot almost flipped her or whipped her around there off of turn number four. Now he's going to pull up side by side with Mike Waddle for a second. It will go to Austin Cool. Look at the outside of him right now is Dennis Guile. So Dennis Guile, that black car, no uh, logos on the side of that hot rod. Just got the body done and put on that car right now. Trying to pass to Austin Cool for a second. As they were side by side, it's Cool hanging on to that spot over Dennis Guile. Then they're kind of stacked up behind him. Fourth on back as they get single file straighten out there down the back straightaway. It's still going to be Tanner Gross showing the way with Austin Cole, Dennis Kyle in that third spot. Fourth is a 7X of Ryan Murphy, the Shamrock Racing Machine. Then you got that beautiful looking paint scheme of the 22G of Aaron Jones right now trying to put the pressure on the 17 machine of Joe Shepner moving his way into the top five. Joe Shetner hangs on to that fifth spot with Aaron Jones in tow, about two car lengths behind him. Speaking of a good battle right now for that second spot, Dennis Gile once again putting the pressure on the tail tank of the 45K of Cools. White flag flies this time for Tanner Grow. And I believe Conrad screwed up. They were supposed to go eight laps here, not six laps. And the checker flag will come out. Looking for the green flag at the cone. It's in the air. And it will be the Shipley's trying to wrangle in those top two spots. Kyle Shipley going to jump out to an early lead as Josh Shipley no sneak past Ronald Webster in the 51. So Kyle Shipley, the younger brother to Josh Shipley right now out front. He'll lead Latner one with Shipley, Josh Shipley in second. Dustin Burkhart in the 34 AZ in third. Side by side there for a brief moment for that fourth position. Ronald Webster and Tyler Most. Most down the inside going to throw the slide job on him. Can't make it stick. Ronald Webster comes back with a crossover. As Dustin Cormney trying to get back in victory lane here this year at Arizona Speedway. Had kind of a down year last year here in the ASCS Santan Ford Desert Sprint Car Series. Right now, though, a car looking very racy here as he's battling Ronald Webster for that fourth spot. Out front, no change. Kyle Shipley has him yarded over Josh Shipley in the 34 AZ of Dustin Burkhart. As those three drivers, they pulled away from this battle for fourth as Dustin Cormie once again going to put the pressure down the inside of Ronald Webster as Bruce St. James throws a slide job at the three machine of Tyler Most. Most tried to fight back with the slider. That car pushes up the racetrack in turn number one. Him and Rick Schumann make contact off of turn number two. Schumann car very slow. They'll get back in the gas. We stay clean and green as white flag flies for Kyle Shipley. Kyle Shipley one more time around here at Arizona Speedway will lead the field off of turn at number four with Michael Most putting around the bottom side of the racetrack. Shipley will win heat race number two over Josh Shipley and Dustin Burkhart. Dustin Cormie comes home in the fourth spot in fifth. It was Ronald Webster beating, or no, yeah, Ronald Webster beat Bruce St. James at the line. 